What is going on everybody? Jumbo Thick here, back with more Total War Warhammer 2. This is our Vlad von Karstein's campaign. I am picking up not too long after we left off. I have had some major setbacks. For instance, Karak and Sar, however the hell you want to say that, has repeatedly fallen away from me. Taken once again by the dwarves. Um, I don't know how they keep coming back. It is insane. They keep just, they're like damn syphilis. They just keep coming back one over and over and over again. Meanwhile, the Wood Elves have become a complete nuisance, like to the point that uh, it's almost unbearable. Meanwhile, I've got dwarves at the Yin Yang just all over the place, um, despite there being nothing over here for them to uh, spawn from. So that's always nice. Um, we are going to... we're going to attempt to take Warpad and finally finish out this settlement. Meanwhile, Sigwald here has managed to retake some of our holdings up here and we're pushing the dwarves out of Ostermark and then hopefully we'll be able to take Beckhafen and then after that, well, once, we, once we have Beckhafen, we'll have a firm foothold here in the north. So that'll be good. Because we need more money to make more units, <laughs> so we can get better units to take over more stuff. Until the Wood Elves leave, I can't leave Fort Sol alone, because I'm having to rebuild it since it got burned down. I'm going to have Heinrich here, Heinrich von Karstein, just chill out in Fort Sol. He's just going to sit here. That is going to be his one and only duty, to sit here and do nothing. Um, meanwhile, we're going to give him, like, zombies and skeletons and things like that to flesh out his army just to get numbers in here. So we will have just sheer numbers to defend, um, Fort Sol from the encroaching Wood Elf, uh, rebellions. Uh, let's go ahead and just get one more money and public order up there. Meanwhile, Vlad. I don't know if we can take this settlement from them because of the hero, and he has three heroes in his army already, so that's five heroes versus Vlad. <laughs> so, chances of me retaking that are slim. Um, almost, in fact, none. So what we're going to do is we're going to move here. We're going to attempt an ambush. We're going to see what happens. Orion might come up. We might be able to snag Orion. Um... We're gonna, if we're going to fight the Wood Elves head on, we're gonna have, it's going to have to be an ambush. Because there's no way we can take on this army, even with our elite army that Vlad's running. We can't, we can't win this fight. Um, it's damn near impossible. They can just snipe me from range. And even if I did win this fight, my army would be so decimated, I couldn't do anything afterwards. So, we really need Ungrim to come out here, fall for this, or... Maybe even one of the uh, one of these Wood Elf armies to come over here and fall for this. I don't know. Unfortunately, it looks like Drombrandal is going to be a pain in the ass. He's probably going to try to hit Carrot Kern. It's very well defended, however. So, even if he does, we might be able to run an uh, army behind him and hopefully uh, stop him from doing anything. The good news is the Empire has been on the retreat. We've done so much damage to their Empire between us and the Dark Elves that have been uh, roaming in that they've really just been a nuisance as far as um, all these ridiculous uh, <laughs> uh, heroes they have just running around messing with my stuff. Um, other than that, they've got nothing. Yeah, for instance, yeah, there we go. Wounded another Necromancer. It's constant. Um, heroes, they're just wasting money. But, um, you know, they don't have to worry about that, so. We might be able to snag that army with Isabella if we take, retake uh, Wartbad quick enough. Alright. Alright, I don't think they're moving, and it's really kind of pissing me off. Neither are they. Hmm. I 
invincible. I would like to burn down this Vorak. Fortunately, Orion's sitting there. We might do this number here. Trying to bait them out. Only problem is... For instance, Ungrim comes out here. That's fine. If Ungrim sees Vlad and immediately comes for him, pushes me away, right? He can't get to me. Pushes me away. Then I've got Orion to worry about. Orion's gonna come in here and screw me up, so I've gotta be very, very careful with what I'm doing. Three turns to a fourth soul has got some good stuff. Start assassinating heroes. Yes. Oh, yes. Two turns, and we should be able to take Warpad. If nothing intervenes. Dolph, stay there. Heinrich will stay there. Sigwald. Sigwald. Meanwhile, we're beefing this place up. Let's keep uh, looking around. We might be able to get him up in the mountains, like Karakungor, and do some light raiding for us. That would be good as well. Move towards Nagenhof. Hopefully we can take Nagenhof. We do need Blood Drinker for Vlad. We need to do that as well um, when we get the chance, as soon as we can get some stuff settled down south. Let's see what these dwarves do. Grumberdolls just losing men left and right. He wants to mess with me, that's fine. They're retreating. Hmm. Stalemate, it looks like. I shall enslave the world. No. Darkness comes. March. Let's kind of get you closer. Just looking. They love their oak so much they might actually back I off. Look at how much he's raiding from us. Annihilate them. One more turn. We can have Vlad. We can do Blood Drinker now, and we might as well do it. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it so we can get Blood Drinker and get that regeneration. Plus all these other uh, buffs. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. I have not seen such a pathetic sight since my father-in-law Otto took his last breath. Is this all that thy empire can muster? What a pitiful age this is. It makes me ponder for the era of worthy foes such as Wilhelm or that wolf knight, Kruger. Not this pathetic squabble of mortal men. Yet my sword thirsts, and so it shall be slaked in the blood of living fools that think to challenge the might of von Karstein. Let the slaughter begin! Yes, let the slaughter begin. Can we? Yeah. 
<laughs> oh god, it's so it's such a powerful ability. And very necessary for the vampire counts to be able to uh, to do and get anything done. If we didn't have this um, vanguard deployment, we would be getting our asses handed to us more often than not. Run them in. Oh yeah, almost forgot our mortis engines. Our blood knights can just run in from the rear here and just destroy. Well, although we can literally run in from the rear, that's fantastic. Slaughter the cattle. <laughs> God. Vlad, you are so you're so good. It is awe inspiring. through all of these guys. It's going to be rather embarrassing even. Oh yeah, this is bad. We're already routed. Got a feeling this can't be it though. There's got to be more. Yeah, they have reinforcements. Good, because otherwise this was going to be uh, super boring. Find out what they've got. Well, Vlad is fighting this general. Pull them away from that. Oh, yeah, they're not going to last long. Not with the mortis engine there, sucking away everything, regenerating our troops. line what do we got Empire Knights Empire Knights 
Also don't rocket batteries. But we might be able to take them with what we've got here. Yeah, because it's going to take them forever to get up there. Or run you guys in. And I think we'll pretty easily take this. Go ahead and give them a big fat leadership debuff. Yeah, as soon as that leadership debuff kicks in, we'll look at them. Crumbling. And they're broken. Hell yes. Alright. Kill up who we can. And we've got Blood Drinker now. Out of his reach, at least. Two turns for Fort Soul. Okay. Is there one more turn for Warp Pad? Yeah, one more, and then we're gonna take Warp Pad. And boy, do we need it. Meanwhile. We need the cash. So we're gonna take it. He can heal up. Probably can even go in an ambush. As we take war bad, we're gonna be way better off than we have been for a long time. Hopefully, we can lure one of these damn armies out. More than likely, Ungram will come out. He's not gonna be able to take the uh, the raiding. I don't think. He might though, for all I know. Dolph can deal with them. What are you going to do? Mess with me, of course. Oh shit. That's a big army.
They're not moving. That is supremely frustrating. I shall enslave the world. Hmm. What do we do to get them to move? First off, let's take Warp Bad. We can we can easily take it now. Um, with the troops that we have. Yeah, we can take this. These I guess are not as good as the rest, but they're still pretty damn good. They should be able to tear through some great swords. Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. I feel pretty confident. All right. Isabella von Karstein. Uh, there's more trees over here. Not that it's really going to matter. We want the wraiths on the inside. Better yet, we'll do it like this. Wraith, wraith, grave guard, grave guard. Kind of like that. We're going to run straight up. Keep you guys back here. Not ready yet? We'll just kind of leave them way back here somewhere. All right, we're immediately gonna move up. Let's have you guys there. There, there, and there. through these guys because they are not able to defend what they should because they're so spread out run you guys over here away from all that fire and this is gonna fall quick looks like as a matter of fact Holding up by these halberdiers. We'll fix that soon. Tank their leadership. Yep. And then we will eat these guys up. Nothing left. Wow, this turned into a full route. the Reich's guard if you can. We're going to try to chew through the mortar. 
So, why don't you guys hit those handgunners? Fly over here. Let's get rid of those mortars. Shit, they're getting torn to pieces out there. I didn't even see that. That's all right. We don't need them. bad. There's no way. Yeah, they're all breaking. Breaking, breaking, breaking. Woof! Got it. Easily destroyed them. Oh. We could use the cash. Even repairing all that, it was still worth it. Put in these bad boys right there. And why not? Get some more corruption in some of the other places. That is a scary ass army. Wow. back to Essen. Which they're definitely going to make a move on Essen. They all, they'll have to. Alright, now that we've taken this, as soon as we get free, we're going to go get rid of Rumbendal. Got a lot of stuff now. Let's go ahead and put in the uh, Vampire's Keep here. So that way we'll have another place for Vlad to just run into and get a uh, get some vampires when he needs them. I will allow. take Vlad over here, bait them into leaving. Yeah, because as soon as we start threatening the Kingsglade and all of this, they're going to pull away. I know they will. Hmm. Save a little bit of cash, though, just in case. Essentially because we just need more, more fodder over here. Good job, Necromancer. Your wish, Master. Right, this Banshee, however. You can move back here. Let's 
go ahead and I guess we'll get some growth in here so we can get this upgraded as quickly as possible. Shit. Here they come. That undefended. Very well. It is done. I knew the way. Bring them death. Oh, yeah. Ooh, you're going to regret that, Ungrim. Strike out. Bet your ass you're going to regret it because now I'm going to take it no. with, with Dolph. Yes. Love it when a plan works out. Where well, this plan up here is not doing so hot. Oof. We're going to be relying on a uh, an ambush here at Essen to keep them back. Because they're, they're going to move in on us, and they're going to. There's no way they're not going to. And we have to get an ambush. Should have a 100% chance, though. So that's a plus. No, Heinrich here. Guess we'll keep him here at Fort Soul. Just to get that garrison up. Every little bit counts. As far as that's concerned. Forty-four thousand. Yes. All right. I guess let's end the turn. Damn doors are making a resurgence. They, they shouldn't have money anymore with how many armies they fielded and they're constantly just unless they just can do actions for free with all of their units which they probably can yes okay it says this is not a good fight for us but dude all they've got are troll hammers <laughs> the lawn beards will have to grind out but just troll hammers? Oh yeah, we definitely are going to be able to rip through this. Um, unfortunately, they've got a bunch of gyrocopters and gyro bombers. So, but let's go ahead and do this. All right, all right, all right. Okay, first off, they're immediately going to run in there and try to distract some of them. If we're lucky, they might get a lot of them. Meanwhile. You guys are going to run in and attack whoever you can while you three come smack them down with the aid of 
our Strigoi. You three will come from the other angle and do the same. Meanwhile, we've got Crypt Ghouls to surround. That should be just about everything, right? Oh no. The Karen Wraiths, which are devastating in and of themselves, follow you. We'll have one of you, I guess, come in this way. We'll just have one of you run in behind these, uh, these Crypt Ghouls. Yeah, I want to end them quickly. will help out quite a bit. Distract those gyro bombers as soon as we get the chance. Okay, yeah, we've already annihilated them. Just keep pushing in. Same thing, guys. Don't let any of these iron drakes or anything else get away. Because that's how we're going to win this. Keeping them distracted. Alright, we've broken all of them. You guys can move over here. Shit. So you can get hold of those iron drakes, guys. Don't let them get any shots off. Slowly but surely, we're getting this. Oh shit. Don't let them get away. down I might add <clears throat> and as soon as they break they're done awesome Are they thinking? Just can't reach him, bastard. But Isabella can reach Grumbrindle. Easily win this fight. Oh, come on.
unstoppable. Still think so. All shall know me and tremble. Begin. Nope. Do not ask me to shame our clan. Alright, alright, alright. Such good news. I don't magic. Does it look like they were treated? Yes, they did. Which means we can finish off this army. Hitting Morgan off. What? Oh shit, he's right there. What is your will? This is not in the Damas Kran. Strigon! The souls are mine. No grudge bearer would do this. Good news is he can't make it. Your desire? Maybe. <laughs> Let's actually get some of that cash back. So we're gonna need it. As well, I really need to. Oh shit. This could go very badly, guys. I might lose an army up north. this oh this is Dolph because he just won that um shit uh, I guess we can start buffing up his grave guard They got me. They got me. God damn it. Oh, God, it's frustrating. It's so frustrating. Oh, how many turns until he's ready, though?
All right, it's gonna be all on Isabella to see what we can do here. Hopefully Ungrim falls for this. We lost all of this. God damn it. Okay. Okay, so it's fine. It's fine, we can recover from this. Vlad's gonna have to help though. I okay, said so we go this way. Head him off at Waldenhof. How long's he gonna be dead for? Two turns? That's alright. Alright. Two turns. We can we can hold him off for two turns. I hope. up to something. Thank God. Thank God they fell for it. Alright, unfortunately we're going to have to fight this, otherwise we're, we'll lose way too many units. We've even got all this. Alright. Isabella von Karstein! I don't want to stay away from him. We are going to be monstrosities in combat, so we're going to bog them down with everything we can. Meanwhile, we will chew through what we can with you guys. Do they have any... Yeah, he's got some damn giant slayers. Let's pair off the giant slayers with our, with our rates. Karen race. They should pair well against them. Let's do what we can over here. I'm not sure how we're going to approach this. It's going to be a hard fight. That's what it's going to be. No doubt we're going to win it. It's just by how much. I'm not sure. down here. Okay, okay, okay. This is going pretty good. Isabella von Karstein! Oh, she's getting her ass kicked. So there's jam of giant slayers over here, no? Chambers, and chambers are dangerous too. I need your help.
Come on. We can outlast him. These guys are pretty much busted down. So all that leaves is them. And then our hero is down here. Take him out. He's the last one. <clears throat> Anybody severely wounded, just get the hell out of there. Up on. How can he be? Oh, hell, it's so long. It's so frustrating. Thirteen hundred. Dear God, how many hit points does the man have? To begin with, it must be crazy. Poor Charlie, so I don't think it's mauled. Unbreakable, so the armor doesn't matter. Maybe that'll be good. Okay. 
down what you can. Get out of there. Can't afford to lose any units. Awesome. Hmm. Like the Wood Elves are amassing for a huge attack. Fantastic. Yeah, there's just a shitload of them gathering. We're not going to stand much of a chance against them. What do you want? I will not betray you. My bloodline calls. I guess let's... Get a whole bunch of damn skeletons. We can finish off that remnant of that army. Let's move over here and let's hope that we can head off what's coming this way. I mean, while we might actually. might actually send the cryptors down this way. They're fast. It's one of the benefits of his army is it's a fast army. Hmm. Is he back yet? I think it's one more turn. Yeah, one more turn. Then we'll start rebuilding Ostrogoy army. But unfortunately guys, I've run out of time and we are no closer to winning than we were before. Matter of fact, we've got a long, long way to go. <laughs> a long way to go. Um, yeah. So, as usual, guys, I've been Jumbo Thick. Thank you very much for watching, and I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next episode. Have a good day.